Hey y'all, what's going on? This is Jesse Both the 19th hole. We're about to do a hole tutorial for hole number one of the upcoming Gridiron Tournament. This is a Santa Ventura hole, uh, par five. And we're gonna be playing it from the first tee. So you can either play this one short with the drive, uh, in which case you could use like a quarterback or something for more control and accuracy. Uh, we're going to play this shot though with the quasar ball and an extra mile. We're going to play this shot a little bit riskier up the left hand side. Um, we're going to try to cut off some of that corner and uh, put ourselves up uh, to try to put ourselves into a long iron distance. So full top and left spin as you see we have to get fairly close to the corner. So a very accurate tee shot is, uh, is definitely a must here. We're using all the curl that we have on our extra mile five. We hit that one perfect. And you see we get a nice bounce. We cut the corner and we hit and we roll just fine. So if you have a higher level extra mile, you have a little bit more curl. So you can play that shot a little bit more, uh, less aggressively along the left hand side of the fairway to be okay. Um, because you will have that extra curl. Uh, you could also go with a katana ball there to give you a little bit more left spin on that shot. Uh, or even a Titan ball if you want to use a Titan ball on that shot. So my opponent here is going for a power hook shot and uh, looks like he's gonna get a nice bounce but is it gonna stay on? Yeah. Oh wow good try right there he almost pulled it off uh, that's definitely another option to play on this hole but as you're gonna see from my next shot it's definitely not um, a needed way to play this hole. So we have our Saturn here. Uh, we're first we're going to find where our max adjustment is and then we're going to line up our ball guide here. Uh, we're going to put a little bit of backspin on this shot and change our spin just enough to, to straighten out that ball guide. Uh, you're going to aim that shot as close as you can uh, in line to the hole and then we're going to play. Um, we ended up playing just about two-thirds of a ring right there for 1.4. We hit a perfect shot and we get the bounce and the roll and as you see this is a very nice roll into the hole for the albatross and definitely a hole where you'll be seeing some of those in this tournament. So I would say to make sure that you do play your spins correctly and those spins may change depending on how far you hit your tee shot. So definitely pay attention to that and hopefully that uh, will help you out in your practice. So. Definitely thank you all very much and hope to see you all on the next video for the Rookie Tutorial.